Hey guys, it's Ross Scott and on Space Catch State we're joined by the man himself because we're going to have a quick first look at this Paul Dameron volume number one Black Squadron. Now let's just have a quick look at it. There we go, there's opening crawl, there he is in his TIE Fighter, there's a great one of the TIE Fighter. What I really uh, like about this, there's his crew, of course, is um, the style of this is very much like the Chewbacca comic. And that's because it's the same people who are doing it. There's Agent Terex, who's going to be his nemesis. And I really like that kind of like flat, almost not so pastely in this one. There's a great one of another version of a Star Destroyer. Um, but and there's a fantastic one there, X-Wings and TIE Fighters going at it. Um, but yes, it's a very soothing style. There's some more, there's some huts there. But I really, really like, it's very happy to have picked this up, of course. I absolutely love Poe Dameron. I haven't finished reading this, but what I did pick up from it is you get that sense of that force of nature that is Poe Dameron, you know. He is witty, he's um, funny, he's brave, courageous. He's always um, telling his guys how much he thinks of them and he's always trying to help them improve. He's just really you know it's Poe Dameron you know and I've been looking forward to this for a long time because um, the new canon for Star Wars has mostly concentrated on the older end the Star Wars comics Darth Vader uh, the Kanans all the one shots that there's been all that sort of thing this is the first one uh, other than a handful of the books that is really in the new era of The Force Awakens so yes that's what's very interesting about it obviously just before the Force Awakens, but it's good to see um, layers in there, of course. Uh, Luke's gets mentioned, and obviously uh, Phasma is in there briefly also, and Hux gets referenced. And like I said, I haven't finished reading it. Maybe some of them make an appearance, I don't know. This is just volume one, there will be others, which I'm very much looking forward to. I will, of course, do a full review once I've completed it, but I want you to just have a quick look. Let's just some more. There's a great one of Poe just raising his glass. See, I mean, it captures him perfectly this is Poe Dameron as portrayed by Oscar Isaac that warmth and that humanity that just spills out of him on the screen is very evident in these pages also and uh, look at that there's a great one <laughs> so yes he's used to being captured and imprisoned I guess I guess he's also good at escaping one way or another so yes anyway guys like I say quick first look overview to come Please subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed this content. Leave me a comment, suggestion, or upcoming topic you'd like to see discussed. I like the video.